Hey everyone, uh, I'm going to show you guys how to use uh, templates in TradingView. Uh, there's a lot of good reasons to use them, like it makes everything quicker. I personally can't really uh, live without them, so let's just say that's where you want to short. I have templates in here for you know supply and demand, demand zone, supply zone. I named all these red because that's where I want to short, right? Let's just say you know your demand's down here or something. I have this all set up as a demand zone like that. That's pretty useful. And let's just say you want your stop down here, right? Well, I have a stop loss one, so SL for stop loss. I changed the, you know, I made it like a spaced out line, SL for stop loss. And say so your take profits up here. And then I have a take profit one as well in green. And you see TP there. So yeah, basically how you do that is uh, you just basically just take your line, right? Or whatever, you, you can do it for anything really. Let's just say you start off with a black regular line, like that. You then, you know, you, cu you, cu you can customize it however you want. You can make it blue, whatever, it doesn't matter. You, put, you can add text here. You can add whatever you want, like review here or something. Like this could be your review line. Like it, you just, it, there's so much to do. Like you could, you could have like a million templates. Like just have all these lines here. So like review here, right? Press OK, and that, like so now you know blue. The blue lines where you review it says it right here. Like you, yeah, you can adjust the text as well. Make it bigger and stuff. Review here. Then you go save drawing template as let's just say review point. Save, and now it's there. Let's just say let's just say you set yourself let's just say you're setting up a trade, right? Like this. So let's just say price comes down here, you buy around here, you place your stop loss line. Right? So you place your stop loss line right there. And then let's just say you want to have a review right before it. Just because you know you want to see maybe you don't want to get fully stopped out there. You just want to review it before, then you click your review point one review here so it just makes everything quicker you know instead of doing it all all at once all the time so you, you kind of have everything saved like I have a bunch I use for here like if I want to highlight the area go to fresh makes it yellow I have all that saved yeah and you can do whatever you want like let's just say trade support and resistance with you know horizontal lines like this is your support well we're on the one hour so let's just say you know, let's just say your yellow line, you just know that your yellow line is your one hour support. And let's just say you want to make the yellow, uh, you can make this one uh, blue. You can save all these templates in here and have them. Like, and let's just say your daily. This is your, all your one hour stuff, but let's just say you want to have a daily support, right? So down here. Right, you want your daily support to be, uh, I don't even know, purple. Right, so purple is your daily support. Then you can have, then you can save the template as just daily support, right? And then you can, whenever, no matter what color you draw, you just put in whatever, what, whatever time frame you're on. Like, it's, it's very useful. Uh, it just makes, like I said, all it does is just it makes everything quicker because, you know, you want to be looking for those opportunities. You know what I mean? So, yeah. That's basically how you use templates. You can do them with basically anything. You can do them with text. I haven't tried everything, but everything I have tried, you can make a template for. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions, just let me know. I'll write them in the comments, and I'll try to get back to you. Thanks.